Pleased to meet you. I'm Knight Dillon. If there's anything you need here, I'll try and help. You got a pip boy. Tune into Galaxy News Radio and listen. It's the only radio station in the Capital Wasteland that really tells it like it is. Three dog is right upstairs. Just stay out of our way and everything will be fine. Let's see the super mutants try and take this place now. Sorry, I'll be in my best. The look on your face says it all. You're wondering who the heck this guy is and why you should care. Well, prepare to be enlightened. I am Three Dog, jockey of discs and teller of truths, lord and master over the finest radio station to grace the wastes, Galaxy News Radio. And you, well, I know who you are. Heard about you leaving that vault, traveling the unknown, just like dear old Dan, huh? Met him already. Hey, when you're in the good fight, you gotta give it all you got and never ever hold back. Always dazzle them, I always say. Always dazzle them and spread the word. Imagine a picture, okay? A picture of the capital wasteland. All that brick and rock. A whole lot of nothing, right? There's people out there trying to just barely make it from day to day. Fighting to stay alive and make something out of what they got. But then you've got all kinds of shit. Slavers, super mutants, raiders. They all want a slice of the pie too. And aim to take it by force. They can't, not against those kind of enemies. They just run away and hide or they stay and die. It just ain't right. So that's where I enter the picture. I fight the good fight with GNR as my gun. The sound of truth goes out across the Capital Wasteland. Hell, someone's got to counter that bullshit on the Enclave Station. Oh, I have plenty of enemies that would love nothing more than to put a bullet between my eyes. The only thing keeping that from happening is Sarah Lyons and the Brotherhood of Steel. We broke it a sweet deal. They keep me from taking a dirt nap, and I keep a strong roof over their head. From what I saw, they were the ones who saved your ass. They keep the ruins super mutant free so people like you can get to people like me in one piece. Without them, we'd be knee deep in muty shit. Sorry, I'm so used to talking to an audience that can't answer, I just assume you want to hear my voice all the time. So, you want to know where your dad is? Fair enough. We got one rule in the good fight, though. You want help, you gotta contribute. You wanna find your dad. And it just so happens his location is known to yours truly. He was here at Galaxy News. We had a great conversation. He's a real stand-up guy. If you want to know more, you're going to have to contribute to the good fight. I like what you're saying, but this is bigger than just you and your dad. If you want help from Galaxy News, you need to contribute to Galaxy News. That's all there is to it. Good. Because this isn't going to be easy. Galaxy News Radio is my baby. I love it. I feed it. I keep it changed. But there's one problem. No one outside of DC can hear her cry. You see, some brainless super mutant thought it would be funny to shoot at the shiny round thing on the Washington Monument. Fine, fine. Since you're too impatient to listen to the details, I'll get to the point. The broadcast relay on the Washington Monument needs to be replaced, and there's only one replacement for it. It's the dish off the old Virgo 2 lunar lander in the Museum of Technology. Hee <laughs> hee! I sure know how to pick them. 
You're gonna be the best thing that ever happened to Galaxy News in a long time. If you need any more info, I'll be here waiting for you.
our new line of subterranean vaults. Triple S technology is Vaultex convergence of the three long and forty yards of a model of endurance. <laughs> Living sections make use of our revolutionary floor suck auto cleaner system for those darned messy kids. Never sweep again. Moms will love how our Culinator 3000 kitchen system makes cooking a breeze. Mmm, I can smell the muffins baking now. Bored? Don't be. Step into our Entertainatron room and watch the latest holotapes, or perhaps listen to a symphony. Another vault tech innovation. Concerns about security? Our eye on you cameras enable the vault to Should the unlikely event arise that the planet is laid to waste, we hope you've enjoyed our tour today. If you have any further questions, please take a brochure from our helpful vault tech guides.
have an insatiable hunger for knowledge regarding the universe. To understand why man is so interested in this unknown expanse of space around our little world, we must take the
Looks like... Hey, all right! The hero of the wasteland returns! Hey, you're the one who deserves all the thanks. You struck a major blow against tyranny. Now, GNR can be heard clear across the capital wasteland again. That'll give Eden and those muties something to think about. But before I get back to my calling, I bet you want to hear about your dad. Whoa now, dry your eyes. A promise is a promise, and I will provide. When your dad passed through here, he and I talked for a good long time. He was a real stand-up kind of guy. He mentioned some scientific mumbo-jumbo which didn't make sense to me, and mentioned something called Project Purity. He also said something about going to visit a Dr. Lee in Rivet City, then he left in a hurry. You never heard of Rivet City? Wow. Just... Wow. Well, a whole bunch of people got together and turned a beached aircraft carrier into a town. Pretty cool, huh? Just follow the river south from here. There's no way you can miss it. I can't even tell you the love I'm getting from the wasteland. Ever since GNR started singing again, the guys downstairs told me that more people than ever are tuning in. It's all I ever wanted. Without this place, DC would be filled with that crap the Enclave keeps shoveling out of their radio station and festering with muties. Someone's gotta tell the Wastelanders what time it is, and Three Dog is the one to do it. No one knows what Eden and his horsemen of the apocalypse are up to. But you can be sure it isn't in the common man's best interest. Three dogs seen it all. The capital wasteland at its ugliest. People killed for scraps of food. Wounded children wandering aimlessly. Some seriously fucked up shit. If it wasn't for the good fight, I think I would have gone crazy by now. Why can't he coat the news when the world is in danger? People like the Enclave would have you believe everything is calm and totally under control. They're lying. Hell, President Eden goes around spreading peace, love, and government, but no one even knows how old that Enclave signal really is. People need to hear the truth. It's a harsh world. We've got to work together to make it better. Not wait for Uncle Sam to ride in and save the day. You've got to understand, if I die, so does the voice of the people. I can't take that risk. Your idea of saving the world means combing through the rubble and using a gun. I use my voice. We're two sides of the same coin. If you think always being a target of your enemies is safe, then you got a funny way of looking at things. Parents? Ha! I was born from the sun and have sand in my veins. Ha <laughs> ha! Just messing with you. My parents were very cool. They preached all about the haters and their bullshit, how to tell the propaganda from the real deal. Okay, go for it. Anytime you need a place to crash, duck in here. Be glad to provide.
Good to see you're staying out of trouble. He said what? Oh, I never did like the look of him. Good point. Come with me. You're about to get an education in wasteland justice. Business in Megatron. You know damn well what I'm talking about. The bomb. You're trying to blow it up. Have you lost your goddamn mind? Sharon. I'm afraid there's been a <laughs> misunderstanding. Someone is surely been spreading the rumors. I'll be sure to address the situation personally. I'm placing you under arrest, Burke. At least until I figure out what the hell's going on around here. And I'm afraid I won't be able to oblige your request, Sheriff. I have pressing matters to attend to. Now, step aside. This isn't open to discussion. You're coming with me. Why do you knuckle-draggers always insist on doing things the hard way? Very well, Sheriff. Lead the way. When you're listening to Galaxy News Radio, we're Radio Free Wasteland. That's right here. No. You've made a grievous error in judgment. Watch your back. You see, children, Blood is so hard to get are simply humans who've been exposed to an ungodly amount of radiation. They haven't had the good fortune to die. Sure, they may look like hideous zombies from an old monster flick, but their hearts, their souls, their tears are all very much... Hey there, glad you're back. So please, if you meet one of the Capital Wasteland's many fools, leave your Good prisoners you. at the door, and your pistol oh. in its holster. <laughs> There shall be no tears, no oh. sorrows, no suffering, or in the division, we shall... Now, you're a man who looks hungry. What do you need? Well, goddamn. You're new, right? Name's Leo Stahl. It's a pleasure. It's a pleasure! Yeah! Sure. Come back anytime. Any then your suffering shall exist no longer. It shall be washed away in Adam's glow. Burn from you with the fire of his brilliance. Each of us shall give birth to I urge you, my friend.
come. Hey Drink there. with me and Ever pray. Ever since Adam's died, this place hasn't been the same. Glorious There's Adam. a fight every night I of the same again. Lesson you're on death's door, I'm busy. I'm Doc Church, and I run this clinic. Now, before you go asking me for help, you'd better know the rules. Rule one, don't bother me. If you do bother me, you better be damn near dead. I'm busy enough taking care of people I actually like. Follow my rule, I'll keep you patched up, I'll keep getting paid, and we'll get along just fine. Oh, you do not. Just suck it up, you big baby. Oh, you do not. Just suck it up, you big baby. I thought you had the look about you. Sure, I can help you, but it's not free. Fifty caps, take it or leave it. All right. I got some of this pre-war stuff. Should flush your system right out. All better now, you big baby. Can I get back to work now? Well, speak up then. I don't have all day. Great. Another junkie. In case you haven't noticed, this is a clinic, not a candy store. And I've got work to do. I'm afraid that goes against patient-doctor confidentiality. All right, look. I'm only telling you this because you seem like an okay sort, and I'm hoping maybe you can talk some sense into the boy. Leo Stahl. That boy got himself a problem with Jet. I've caught him in here two to three times trying to steal what I keep around for anesthetic. Not even his own family knows it. He goes up to the water treatment plant at night to get high. I don't know. I can't reach him. Maybe you can. Yeah? What do you need? You done? Good. Hey. You're looking to trade, stranger? Check out Craterside Supply. 